If you are having problems to install the Air Music technology plugins in your MPC software, then here's the solution. Stay tuned. Mr. Welcome to Mr. DK TV. This video is brought to you by my sound company. Sounds premium. You got problems to install your plugins from Air Music Technology in your software, in your MPC software, then here's the solution. I recently installed the plugins from Air Music Technology. One was a plugin called Air Multiband Filter Bank. And the second one was Subfactory as a plugin from Air Music. I ran into the problem that it doesn't show up in my software, in my MPC software. And I know why, so just follow me. Here you can see my uh, two plugins that I have recently installed. Uh, one is the uh, Air Multiband Filter Bank, and the other one is the Subfactory plugin from Air Music Technology. And when you want to find these plugins, you can see where they are, where they have been installed. It is under Windows C in my case, under Programs, and then I'm choosing the directory Akai Pro. And there you can see I have a folder called MPC, and I have also a new folder called Synths. And that is a problem in my case, because when I'm opening up this folder here since you can see it has been installed to this directory and when I go to my MPC software right here I can't find them so when I go to my mixer for example and I want to load up the plugin from Air Music Technology I go to EQ filter right here Air Music Technology and then you can see there are a few plugins already installed, but the one that I have recently installed is missing. So the software can't find anything. And you have to make sure always that you have scanned your software. When you go to preferences, you will find uh, this window right here. You go to plugins and you have to go to scan new and then the MPC software is scanning for new plugins. But this I have done, but it can't find the plugins. So the solution for this is quite easy if you know how to do it. I have completed the scan and I have done it, but still there is no filter available. And the same is also with my other plugin called Subfactories. You can see it right here, the filter is not there what I want to use, so I close it again and now I go back to my folder and when I go to my folder MPC and then I go here, I have a Synth folder right here in this folder. When I click on it I can see a lot of plugins which are installed right here. I don't know why the software is doing it, but it created a completely new folder which is located here and all I have to do right now is to click on these things, the installed plugins right here. I just highlight them like this and I copy them over to the other directory right here. So I go here to since right here and there I paste it and yes he's asking me administration rights and I hit continue I hit continue again for the second plugin and now it is right there and when I go to my software then I'm opening up the EQ and filter again going to the Air Music Technology thing again and it's still not available but this has something to do with the fact that I have to rescan my plugins again. So I go right here, go to plugins again and I tell the machine to scan new. And now it is scanning the plugins again to find the plugins that I need. That I can use my plugins. So that's the thing that I have to do. And I don't know why they didn't have implemented it, 
but it's the way it is. So this is a workaround. When I go back to my EQ filters right here, Air Music Technology, you can see now my Air Multibank filter bank is there. I hit select and there it is. Boom, I can use my Multibank filter bank like it should be. And the other thing is with the plugin, Subfactory. When I go to my plugins, over here, this icon here shows my plugins, I go right here and then you can see that my plugins now have Subfactory inside because I have rescanned everything in my software and before that I have just copied over the files to the directory where it should be installed to. And I hit Subfactory, I just hit select and then you will see Subfactory is directly there. So this is how I have overcome the problem and I can also use my MPC preset expansion when I go over to my browser again. You can see my brand new MPC preset expansion for Subfactory is there and I can just preview the included presets. I'm a piano zero run. Then I can just load it up, hit load, and then it is directly there in my software. And now you can see it's right here, Ama Piano 01. There it is. I can play it, I can tweak and dial everything in that I want. I can do some changes. Whatever I want to do right now, it is right there. I hope that this video was helpful for you. Please tune in next Sunday, 9 o'clock, Mr. DKTV. Greetings from the east of Africa. I'm out of here. Blessings.